Hi, welcome to Raw Math. Today I'm doing a series of videos on systems of equations and solving them through algebraic manipulation. Okay, this particular problem I'm going to solve through elimination. The reason I'm going to do elimination is because the way it's set up, the x's are in line, the y's are in line, the equal signs are in line, as are the numbers. If I just put a line under here and add down, because the y coefficient, coefficient means number multiplied to variable, the numbers multiplied to y, the coefficients are equal, they're both one in value, but opposite, positive, negative, and sign, meaning if I add down y minus y, the y's will eliminate, thus elimination. I get 2x equals 34, and when I divide by two, I get that x is equal to 17. Okay, so now I need to figure out y. So 17 plus y equals 22. If we subtract 17 from both sides, we get that y is equal to five. So now we have this answer, 17, five, but I could have made a mistake. So let's check it. Check it with the second equation. Is 17 minus five really equal to 12? It is and I'm very secure in my answer. The beauty about systems is you can always check your work really easily. Okay, if you notice, again, we have this nicely set up, equal coefficients, opposite and sign. We can add down again. We get 10x, the y's cancel, the y's eliminate, equals 30. If I divide by 10, I get x is equal to three. Okay, so this is gonna be a little bit harder. 5 times 3, let's minus 4y equals 13. I just put this 3 into the first equation. I'm putting it into the first. I'm checking with the second. I pretty much will do that in all my videos so that if you want to pause and try it yourself, you can predict the way I'm going to solve this. So 15 minus 4y is equal to 13. I'm going to subtract 15 from both sides so that negative 4y is equal to negative 2. Be careful. Um, negative 4 divided by negative 2 divided by negative 4. A lot of times people say 2 because they want big divided by small, but the big is in the denominator, so y is equal to 1 half. Don't go to decimal because this is skill and drill, and unless you are given a decimal or told to go to decimal, assume precision, and precision is a fraction. Okay, so now we're going to check our work. We have this answer, three comma one half. We want to find out if it's correct. We check it in the second equation. Is five times three plus four times one half really equal to 17? Is 15 plus two really equal to 17? It is, so now I'm secure in my answer. All right, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, like my Facebook page, See you on the next video. Thanks.